Here we are in Thailand and Nong Kai, and we're going to have a walk through on one of the new SLP lines that have been installed. Let's take a closer look. This line is typically used for smaller diameter timber and up to a maximum length of 3.6 meters. This line is SLP1 configuration. I'm going to start you at the beginning of the line and walk you through. This is the automated log in feed deck. Your forklift will load um, logs onto the deck from your log yard. Logs come up the log in feed deck. They get fed into the first breakdown saw, which is our twin vertical saw. This is two vertical blades that saw off the sideboards of the log. Can take a maximum log length of 3.6 meters, maximum diameter of 400 millimeters. Once it passes through, the sideboards automatically fall onto this cross transfer deck which are then moved along the line for further processing. The next machine in the line is the single vertical saw. This is designed to take off the third side of the log. So after the log passes through here, we would typically turn it on its side. The single vertical saw will take off the third side. This allows the log then to be positioned upright, a nice square cant, that can then go through the forehead resaw at the end of the line. This is the HR500 multi-head resaw. This machine can be configured in a two, four or six head, depending on what sort of setup you require. This allows you to customize your cutting. The size changes on the head can either be computerized or be done manually. The computerized version just helps you to change the sizing quicker. If you're cutting lots of different log sizes, it just helps your operator to be able to be more versatile. The manual version, you generally would set it for a shift and then run it and then change it only after a couple of hours.